all right y'all so in today's video as y'all seen by the title i'm gonna be showing y'all how i slayed this kinky straight wig by nandula hair this is a v part unit and i did do a little mini tiktok of me doing this hair of course this will be the full end-up video make sure y'all go follow my tiktok and let's just get straight into this tutorial i'm gonna show y'all how i got this natural look <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. My name is Key Andrew. As y'all seen by the title and a little bit of the intro, I'm gonna be showing y'all how I slayed this Nadula straight kinky unit. Y'all, this unit is so bomb, so soft. We about to get into the details. I'm just showing y'all what came in the box. Um, everything that I received in the box with my unit. I believe this was a 24 inch um, kinky stray wig. This is one of those V-part wigs. Really, really easy to install. You ain't got to deal with too much lace. Really no lace actually. Um, no glue and all that extra stuff. So yeah, these units are really popular nowadays because they're low maintenance and really easy to install. So I'm just showing y'all the construction of the unit. Um, it comes with a bunch of clips and it comes with the elastic band in the back to adjust it and also the clip in the back boom we ripping our rig off yep just straight like that i'm <laughs> just showing y'all what my foundation is looking like i have some really really old braids in and this is one of those units where you're supposed to be able to wear it um without any leave out but i didn't like how it was looking without no leave out y'all and i was going to be flat ironing it and making it straight so i just felt like i couldn't do a good job of concealing the top of this unit unless there was leave out and y'all your girl ain't had no heat to her natural hair in freaking years i have not i mean the most i've had was like of course a blow dryer but even then i don't even blow dry my hair anymore so it's been a minute but your girl did some leave out for the sake of the unit forget it and my hair has grown out a lot y'all know if y'all been following my channel for a while that i did a big chop about a year ago and some change now so yeah y'all just see me looking at it i was like i said i was playing with it trying to see if i wanted to wear it um the natural like no leave out no lace no glue look but like i said see i was trying to conceal it it just wasn't working out for me so y'all gonna see me actually take two of my braids out of my hair i didn't show the full process but i'm gonna take two braids out of my hair and use that as my leave out i have very minimum kind of <laughs> leave out and since this is like a textured like you know kinky straight wig it definitely blends with natural hair that's something that i really really like about these units as well you can get them to blend with your hair really easily so yeah i went the leave out method um like i said though this wig you should you're supposed to be able to wear with no leave out so if you don't want to do no leave out chain gotta do no leave out but here i am taking the braids out and kind of like taking out some edges i guess you want to call them out so yeah that's what y'all see i just twisted the leave out and i'm clipping the unit in place around the leave out and like i said i was also recording a tiktok so make sure i go follow my tiktok i will have it linked in the description box down below um so yeah i'm just showing y'all how much i took out and y'all the rest is history i really don't want to ramble too much make sure y'all check out all the links in the description box down below if you want like full details on this hair it was super thick super soft really really easy to work with all i had to do was straighten it because it is a kinky straight unit and it was really really big so i'm definitely like it i definitely liked it the more like straight look if that makes any sense like the more flat iron look so yeah when i got done just know it was giving a natural rapunzel it was giving a black rapunzel it was giving this was my hair it was growing out of my scalp so yeah make sure i go follow me on instagram as well because i did post pictures with the hair so yeah quiet please i'm sorry y'all like bella <sighs> child she a piece of work but anyways y'all just gonna see me style the rest of this hair like i said the rest is history if you are interested in this unit which i 100 percent recommend if you're looking for a natural unit low maintenance with no lace no glue which is a win-win all around the board sis go ahead and cop this wig i will have the links again down below in the description box as well as the inches and everything like that and yeah y'all could just basically watch me install this unit super easy super super easy thank you so much nadula here for sponsoring this video and yeah, I'm gonna just let y'all watch the rest of the video.
Y'all, I honestly don't forgot all about the leave out life. Uh, so I really didn't put any product on my hair like that. Y'all see me put a little bit of bio silk on the hair and my hair. And I don't even know, to be honest, if that was the best product to use. Because again, I have not had leave out in years. So like I said, that leave out life, I'm not really about it. But I just straightened my hair and I was trying not to go through it too many times because child, he damaged. Um... So yeah, I was just kind of winging it. I knew I was not going to be keeping up this hairstyle in too long because like I said, I really don't do leave out like that. So, and I know myself, like if I got leave out, I'm dang near going to be trying to put heat on it every day because my hair is not used to heat. It's not used to being straight and I'm going to know, and I know I'm going to want it to look straight all the time. So anyways, that's besides the point. Y'all just see me getting it as straight as I can. And I did use a little bit of my wax stick that I actually be using on my, um, my lace wigs. Uh, just to lay down any flyaways and then I did just use some edge control on my edges as like a little natural edge look I didn't do too much for the um, edges or anything I just kept it real natural because that is what the wig gave me it gave me like a very natural vibe it gave me my natural hair was straight and just longer like that's what the look was going for so I wanted everything to be you know corresponding to that so y'all just see me putting a little bit of edge control on them and like I said, I used a little bit of my wax stick. That's just in case anybody was interested in to see like what I actually did for the leave out part. But y'all, that really was it. Didn't do much. Only wore this unit um, for like a few days. So yeah, y'all just see me playing with it. But yeah, that's basically it. Thank you so much for watching this video if you did watch the whole thing. And shout out to Nadula. It's looking like um, a silk press. Well, maybe not a silk press, y'all. A silk press after a few days. <laughs> silk press with a little humidity it just looks very very natural like if i was to straighten my natural hair like i don't know let me know what y'all think again shout out to nadula for sponsoring this video make sure you follow my instagram and my tiktok which are linked down below and subscribe to your girl channel if you are not and i will see y'all in the next video oh and like this video if you enjoyed it <laughs>